for a year with Galway then, um, what was it, what was your thoughts when you saw that Henry Shefflin was getting the job? Um, I suppose obviously your first thought is excitement because like as a young lad you'd be growing up, you'd be watching Henry on the TV and, and you'd be idolising him. So just to get the chance probably to learn off him and to see what he's about. And then when you hear the backroom team, Kevin Lally, Damien Joyce and the likes of them lads, you know, like you know you know it's a good hurling hurling team that a good hurling setup say that's been brought in. So it's probably excitement I'd say would be the overall feeling. And was he what was what's he been like in the dressing room and was he different than what you expected in the dressing room? Yeah, I suppose it's hard to know what to expect when, when you when you first meet him. You don't know to know what kind of a guy he is. But I suppose after like two or three meetings, you know straight away like he's just a genuine sound hurling man. Like he just he wants the best for gold hurling and the best for you as a player. Like so, you know you can't complain that way. Yeah, and um, like how do you feel year one went? I mean, from the outside looking in, I would have thought good at times. Then the last twenty minutes of the Leinster final didn't go great, and then obviously a good performance in defeat to Limerick. Yeah, I suppose we're. <sighs> You could say it was a good year if you wanted, but I suppose that's not what we're after. We're after all Ireland's, and you didn't win all Ireland, so it wasn't a good year. Like probably, I wouldn't say we were disappointed with the year. We got to an All Ireland semi final, could have, probably should have bet Limerick. If, if, you know, um, didn't turn up in the Leinster final. So like, obviously this year we have to right them wrongs as best we can.